Hello everybody, welcome back to Wrestling Rampage. I'm Joey, and today guys, I'm going to show you guys what I picked up on Facebook Marketplace. It was a hell of a score. Um, you know, granted, there's nothing wowing except for a few games in this lot, but uh, I don't have a lot of these games, and yeah, they're all loose, but oh well, right? Uh, you guys seen the photos in the beginning. Uh, it's this case. It's a... Um, it's a 3DS, um, yeah, see, there it is, Nintendo 3DS uh, Legend of Zelda um, case. Um, the case, I looked up on uh, on uh, eBay, this case is worth like 10 bucks, it's not really worth a ton, but the lot, I, the lot uh, that inhales in this, uh, now no system, but just the games. Go ahead and open this up. We have games, and we have even more games. So let's get into it, guys. Uh, the sis, yeah, the uh, the the um, this case is worth like ten bucks. I'm probably going to bundle this with a 3DS. I'm going to sell, and uh, you know, make it just a little bit better for uh, for them. Let's go ahead and open this up. We have the first game here is. For the Nintendo DS, we have... Here, let me move this out of the way. There we go. Uh, for the Nintendo DS, we have Call of Duty World at War. Um, you know, I'm not a big Call of Duty fan. Uh, I love Modern Warfare, but uh, I haven't... I, I've never played these on DS. I mean, they, they may be a good... They may be even better on DS. I don't know. But Call of Duty World at War Loose is worth $11. Like, every game except for one is worth 10 or more, guys. I mean, it's insane. Let's go ahead and go with the next one. For the Nintendo DS, we have Assassin's Creed, made by Ubisoft. Licensed by Nintendo. And, um, yeah, this, this, this cartridge is worth... Ten dollars. Now, now, all these are according to price charting, which is just kind of like an estimated value. That doesn't mean that it's exactly ten. It may be like twelve. It may be even eight dollars. And you know, if you buy it like off eBay, but these are just average prices for these for these games. But a ten dollar cartridge, Assassin's Creed, uh, which I, I I enjoy some of the Assassin's Creed games. Never played one on the DS, so it might be fun. For the Nintendo DS, uh, we have Assassin's Creed 2 uh, Discovery. Um, looks like it had some sticker residue on it. Residue. But uh, this one is worth $13. Wow. Uh, loose. That's pretty cool. Uh, cool that I actually have Assassin's Creed 1 and 2. So that's, 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 that's awesome. Next, we have a classic, which I own this complete, so this is going to be a bundler or whatever. For the Nintendo DS, we have New Super Mario Bros. There we go. Now it's, now it's inside there. Very clean. Awesome game, by the way. Uh, it is worth $12 loose, which is pretty cool, actually. Now we got the one that's worth the least in this one, and it's a 3DS game. Uh, I may keep this, or I may not keep this. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if the boy wants it or not. Uh, my son, he might, he, he he might like, he might end up liking it and playing it. For the Nintendo 3DS, we have Adventure Time. Explore the dungeon because I don't know. Is what the name of it is. Uh, I never watched Adventure Time, so I have no fucking idea on if it's a good game or not, or a good show or not. It never really appealed to me anyway, so I don't know if it's any good. Uh, but this is cartridge only, and it's worth $6. So, very cheap 3DS game. But nonetheless, it came in a lot, so... Let's go ahead and keep going. We have for the now this is pretty cool because I actually have this on uh, on Wii U and I've played it. I enjoyed it. For the Nintendo 3DS, we have uh, 
Ultimate NES Remix. This on the Wii U is fun as hell, so I'm, I'm assuming in handheld mode it might even be pretty damn good as well. So, uh, definitely keeping this in the lot. Um, this cartridge is worth $11 loose. So that's cool. Let's go and go to the next one. For the 3DS, I don't have this. I don't have this one either. Uh, Super Mario Maker 3DS. Um, I ended up buying this for my son um, for Christmas last year or something like that. And he's actually been enjoying it. So uh, I, I, have, I also have this on Wii U as well. Uh, it might even be cooler on 3DS. I don't know. But we'll find out. Also, an $11 game. So that's cool. Uh, yeah, a lot of these I'm going to keep. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, we'll, go, we'll go one by one at the end on what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to get rid of. But let's keep going here. We have for the, <laughs> for the Nintendo 3DS, another one. We have Mario Kart 7. I played Mario Kart 7. Actually, Mario Kart 7 is actually a fun fucking Mario Kart uh, for the 3DS. Uh, I think it's a 3DS exclusive, actually. Um, so, uh, yeah, if you find Mario Kart 7, it's actually a really good uh, Mario Kart. But it's only for handheld. Uh, worth $10 loose. It's pretty cool. I don't have Mario Kart either. Uh, now we're going to the last couple of games here. And if you guys are Zelda fans, then you'll actually really enjoy these. We have... For the 3DS, we have The Legend of Zelda Triforce Heroes. So that's pretty cool. Not a big Zelda fan, but I do know that Zelda is a staple in, in in Nintendo and a lot of people love Zelda. Me personally I don't, but if I can find these games for dirt cheap I will pick them up. Uh let's see loose thirteen dollars. Nice. Next one for the Nintendo 3DS we have Legend of Zelda A Link Between Worlds Loose. And all these are really clean, except for the one that had sticker residue on the back of it. But everything else is actually super clean, super nice. But, uh, yeah. Legend of Zelda, A Link Between Worlds. This loose is worth $18. Not bad. And then we have the last game, which is worth the most. Not 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 too much more, but for the 3DS we have Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask 3D. I've been really wanting to pick up a lot of 3DS games because they're actually kind of starting to like at this particular time, 3DS and Wii U games are kind of on the downturn. Um, where you can get them for decently cheap. I'm assuming. In the next two or three years, 3DS systems, 3DS games. Uh, we, we're already starting to see it with Wii U. Wii U games are kind of uh, skyrocketing somewhat, certain ones. And the system is worth like fucking $200. If you, uh, $150 to $200 if you find a Wii U. Um, so, I mean... I'm assuming that uh, you know this is, these are going to skyrocket in value later on. That's why I'm trying to get them now. I don't care if they're loose or not. I don't care personally. But some people want them in the case. Uh, now, once again, would I want them in the case? Absolutely. But uh, you're going to take what you can get, and you're going to take it for cheap. So, but yeah, Majora's Mask 3D, The Legend of Zelda for the Nintendo 3DS, and those are all everything I picked up. We have 8, 9, 10, 11 games uh, in this lot, and uh, that's pretty cool, though. And then, we, and then we also have this Legend of Zelda case, too, so that's, that, that's actually pretty neat. So, um, 
I got all this off Facebook Marketplace. Uh, I wrote the guy, asked him if he had the system, and he said he doesn't have a system anymore. I guess maybe he sold it. But, um, oh, did I tell you guys that Majora's Mask is worth $20? I'm not sure if I actually said that or not. But uh, Majora's Mask 3D is worth 20 But, yeah, uh, a lot of the, like, a lot of these I'm actually keeping for my collection personally. Uh... Call of Duty, uh, maybe, maybe not. I'm going to keep the Assassin's Creed games. Uh, I'm going to keep uh, these. Actually, I'm going to keep all these right here. Everything right here I'm keeping, these three are going to be up for debate. This I already own, so I know I won't be keeping that. But uh, these two are going to be up for debate. So, But honestly, a pretty damn good haul for some loose games and literally uh the guy had it up there for i don't know 15 minutes before i seen it uh let's see uh we went to price charting for the games and then the case we got off of ebay listings but a hundred and forty five dollars is how much everything is worth right here a hundred and forty five dollars on Facebook Marketplace, the guy just wanted 50 bucks. So I paid him, I gladly paid him $50 for everything you see here. And all these games, except for this one, all these games right here are worth like $10 plus. So it was worth it, no doubt. Yeah, this one, you know, is what it is, but all these were worth at least ten dollars and up so it was worth a fantastic deal uh total savings of 95 dollars almost saved almost saved a hundred bucks but not quite hope that you guys enjoyed it if you guys did make sure you guys give it a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed don't forget to share all over social media like us on facebook facebook.com slash wrestling rampage to follow us on twitter at russell rampage as well as follow me and tommy on instagram and we'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button.